Reaction from the director, Hatzel. Louis, remember the director was already angry. He said he was shocked over the video that we've seen uh, all day today. Today he's saying though, this police officer has to go. The Miami-Dade police director in two tweets says he's starting the process of firing the police officer seen in this video, adding he's holding his officers accountable for their actions. These are newly released documents, an account of what happened written by Officer Anthony Rodriguez himself. It was Tuesday, 8 p.m. at the American Airlines rebooking counter near Gate 37. Rodriguez says Paris Anderson was yelling obscenities at the American Airlines employees. 21-year-old Anderson was late to the gate, denied boarding, and subsequently missed her Chicago flight, told she would have to fly the next day. When police try to escort her away, what you want to do? this is where body cam video picks up the rest of the showdown. The president of the union representing officer Rodriguez tells us how he sees the video. She's got no mask on. She's up in his face. She walks into him and she pushes her face into his face. What you want to do? Stetman Stahl calls it a diversionary strike, an open hand slap, a way to get her into custody. It was uncalled for. Miami-Dade County Mayor called the video appalling and the use of force unnecessary. Officer Rodriguez has been with Miami-Dade Police 31 years, 28 of them as an officer. I hope that the officer gets his due rights. That was the president of the police union. By the way, now the state attorney's office is getting involved. Prosecutors are looking at this video to see if this officer will be charged. For now, reporting live from Miami International Airport, I'm Hatsovala, Local 10 News. Yes, yeah, disturbing video there. Oh, thank you, Hatsovala.